Hello and welcome to our Wednesday's financial news. Stay with us for more market headlines. The euro has started the week with gains as the eurozone final CPI improved to 1.5%, matching the forecast. Still no news from UK PM May, but the sterling is holding its ground for now as Brexit trade talks get underway. Apple Inc. has increased the prices of most of its iPhone models sold in India after the government last week raised taxes on imported phones. The euro-dollar pair is looking indecisive at this point. The stochastic RSI has shown some back-and-forth movement, now settling in the neutral area. The sterling dollar pair is currently neutral. The ATR went from the high volatility area into the low volatility area. The Aussie dollar pair currently has a vast majority of bullish indicators. The MACD has moved sharply into the bullish area in the last 24 hours. The dollar yen pair currently has a vast majority of bearish indicators. The Williams oscillator is now signaling bearish after recently dwelling in the bullish area. The US EIA crude oil stock exchange will be released at 15.30 GMT. The Eurozone's current account at 0900 GMT. New Zealand's gross domestic product at 21.45 GMT. The German producer price index at 0700 GMT. The Canadian wholesale sales at 13.30 GMT. And the US MBA mortgage applications at 1200 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed our Wednesday's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to visit us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.